active is noticed by a policeman from a distance of 200 meter the thief starts running and the policeman chases him the thief and policeman run at the rate of 10 km and 11 km per hour respectively when the distance traveled by the thief before being caught so if this is police this is thief this police notices this thief at a distance of 200 meter when the police notices this thief this thief starts running and the police start chases him here thief speed is 10 km per hour and police speed is 11 km per hour there is a distance between police and thief so speed of police must be greater than speed of thief then only police can catch this thief so find the distance traveled by thief before being caught so this thief will travel a distance and at a point x i will take this point as x this police will catch this thief that means this thief will travel a distance d so police will travel distance d plus 200 so distance traveled by the first d and distance traveled by police is d plus 200 meter here you can see both distance and speed are varying that means time is constant here time is constant here whenever time is constant distance is directly proportional to speed here you can see Time taken by the thief to reach this point X is same as time taken by the police to reach this point X. That's why police catch this thief at a point X. So here time taken by thief is same as time taken by police. That is why time is constant here. So whenever time is constant, distance taken by police divided by distance taken by time is same as speed of police divided by speed of thief here you already know speed of police is 11 km per hour and speed of thief is 10 km per hour that means distance taken by police divided by distance taken by thief is same as 11 by 10 here difference between 11 part and 10 part is one part and difference between distance taken by police and distance taken by thief is 200 meter because distance taken by thief is d and distance taken by police is d plus 200 so the difference is 200 meter here you can see one part is same as 200 meter so distance traveled by thief is 10 parts so 10 part is equal to 200 into 10 that is 2000 meter because one part is equal to 200 meter So distance traveled by thief is equal to 10 parts. Distance traveled by police is 11 parts. So your answer is option A, 2 kilometer. So 2000 meter is 2 kilometer. So distance traveled by thief is 2000 meter. So this is 2000 meter. That means this thief will travel a distance 2000 meter and the police will travel 2.2 kilometer.